Hello. <laughs> and uh, happy holidays. Guys, I upgraded and I got some um, liquid chalk markers because I was just like, wow, the chalk idea that I wanted was looking too chalky when I looked at my video, the self-care video. I was like, okay. I think it's about time I've changed it. So I got me some nice chalk. So welcome to another video. If you are new here, then you know, welcome. And if you're an OG, then like keep being an OG. What's up? How you doing? We already know each other. So that's about it. Um, and this is the part of the video where you're like, wow, does she have pants on or not? Cause you don't know. Cause, cause you just don't know. You just don't know. I'm in my own house. You know what I mean? But, um, that's what you're going to have to find um, if you subscribe to my OnlyFans. So, I'm kidding. I want to, to spread um, some holiday cheer. Because I will say, like, now having a job and working like five days a week um, in this past couple months it's it, it's been draining and you know doing other events on the side and things like that um first world problems it's not a big issue it's just draining on me as a person and I think I've also haven't been taking care of myself properly and like doing what I need to do to be my best you know so I just I, I slipped a little bit I slipped a little bit not gonna lie to I was I actually wasn't gonna make a video but then I got I was just gonna make like a shoot, cute short video and be like, oh guys, like, I uh, hope your holiday is great. But then I was like, you know, I want something. I want to give you guys something. And I was like browsing on Netflix. And then I was like, let's get into the Christmas spirit with my mom. And let me put on a movie. I put on this movie. Um, it's Naj Naja Christmas. I might be saying the name wrong. So I'm just gonna put it on the screen on there. So uh, it was actually an African movie. Uh, for the Christmas time and it was about three brothers who mom is like the counselor of the committee and this is her 10 year so um, one of the mother like it's like oh I got a grandchild and she was like you got three boys and you ain't got no grandchildren yes, indeed. to the glory of God <laughs> hallelujah yes indeed. I Vitinez Bakuridi became a grandmother. <laughs> it was more like a insecurity of her own because she wanted grandkids. And um, none of the boys were in a relationship that could, you know, give him that. Except one. But, you know, you gotta you gotta watch the movie. Yes, absolutely. You are the cause now. And what have I done to you boys that you are punishing me like this? It was also, let me tell y'all, there were so many different plots in the movie and like different moving parts in this movie, but I will say I really loved how they had like Christmas in Africa, you know, cause we think Christmas were like, oh, it's cold, you know, even in like California, I saw like some people had like, um, the lights on their cat, not cactus. Why am I saying that? On their plants, on their plants, whatever plants they had out there you're from California and you have lights on your plants, you know, go you. <laughs> Cause I'm like, if it's not a pine tree, I'm like, what is it? Okay, that's terrible. But um, yeah, it was just really great in the movie of how they brought in like African music with, uh, with the Christmas music and like just interpreting it and making, making it their own. And you honestly didn't know where the story was gonna go. And that's what I really loved about it. And like the, 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 the acting, the acting for this movie was, I loved it. I loved it. It was because it was more like, um, theatrical in a sense. But you know, if you, if you met African people, it's very, it's very theatrical. <laughs> like when they talk, like the expressions that they use and like, it was just so good and all the colors. That's the one thing I really love is the garments is just all the colors that the people wore and like, 
this is not really a spoiler really but when you see it when you watch the movie you'll see it i love that instead of having like christmas tree because you know they didn't have christmas trees you don't have a pine tree out there so they the people brought like three canoes or something i think it's canoes and they just made it into their own christmas tree <laughs> It was a really well done movie. The comedy was great. The characters were great. This man right here deserves some recognition because the way he had me rolling, he said, listen, where's Torpedo? Because somebody got to catch these hands. He, for me, was the highlight for me. Like, it's he's so funny. And I also loved, um, there's this one character, Tony. He just come in and he's just smiling with his bodyguard named Javelin. Just this very tall, intimidating black guy is Javelin, who's basically the muscle. <laughs> hey, it's OB hashtag Mogon rejection guy. And the way he comes in, he reminds me of, you know, who framed Roger Rabbit? Just the weasels? That's what he reminds me of. This is my livelihood, man. This is all I've got. You want to come on? I have to, I will. Can you stop? Oh, don't touch it. Hey. Hey. <laughs> and the mother the mother was funny oh my gosh every time she's like oh my boys oh you want to ruin my life and i'm like oh my gosh sometimes mom you know moms you know moms they just want to say things sometimes and it just makes no sense you're like wow i'm really i'm existing and and I'm really hurting you by not doing what you want me to do, like, because... Mama! Mama, don't work like that. Yeah, I really wanted to keep this video really short um, for myself and editing. And, you know, I just want I want to get the message short and concise. I want to start getting the message short and concise. So, um, please watch uh, the movie. It's such a great movie. Um, I will also link it in the description box below because these, this movie needs to be pushed up. In the Netflix algorithm okay it needs to be pushed up and people need to share this because it's just really nice seeing movies of other cultures oh and I think that's what's beautiful about like different cultures is that they're gonna have a different idea on how to create the movies and how they're gonna make things work because of their budget and how it relates to their culture like the canoe for the Christmas tree and it was right really nice and it was also, the movie exposed, like, a bit of classism, which is everywhere, and how these, like, counselors were like, oh, we're gonna do this for the people, and people are gonna love it, but then the lady wanted to extend it to, you know, the ghetto, and they were like, oh, <laughs> the ghetto, you know, so <laughs> it was just, it was, it was a really well-made movie, and if you get the chance, please watch the movie. Um, I'm glad I watched it, and that that's my, that's my Christmas present to you. That's what I can give you through the screen. So that's what we're doing here right now. Thank you guys for watching. I got some new things that I want to do for the new year. I'm not going to say anything or hype it up because um, only time will tell. So, <laughs> but it'll be good stuff. It'll be good stuff. Um, thank you for watching. I want to wish you guys a happy holidays, you know, and a happy new year. You know, stay safe out there on these streets, you know. Omnicron, the new Decepticon, is out here snatching everybody. Snatching everybody. So, you know, get tested as much as you can. Um, and, um, you know, stay safe out there. Happy holidays. Happy New Year.